every time I do a verification, I learn something about a lab, about a trainee or about a training officer that I haven't come across before. It's been fabulous CPD for me. Also, I have a um, huge uh, sense of uh, achievement and gratification for helping somebody to get through uh, their registration and to join our registered body and to go out into the world as a biomedical scientist. Definitely, definitely. Um, I'm really confident now as a, a training officer myself. Whenever you see a really good idea, I always ask the training officer, that's something that I would like to use. Can I have your permission to use it and to develop it, to change it a little bit, to give my trainees that opportunity as well. So I feel that in my role as a training officer, uh, it has 100% benefited me to become a better training officer and to understand the registration process so much better than I ever did before. My favourite thing, of course, has to be when you tell them that they've passed. I've been very, very fortunate that in the nearly 100 that I've done, there have only been a couple that I've felt the need to uh, defer. So that means that most of mine that I do you are giving great news at the end that you have passed uh, you've passed your verification and that I am going to recommend uh, the certificate of competence to the IBMS and that is a fabulous feeling it's career changing for that person I would say to to all those verifiers and potential verifiers out there please come forward please recognize that there are a potential 140 plus biomedical scientists out there to join our workforce and we need to get them onto the bench uh, and uh, you know working in the role the career that they have chosen so that they can support our pathology services and support our patients who need those results.